ransacking stores. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome back to the Crypto Bully Bay channel with the only fun the Cody and no financial advice. Retailers like Target say she's getting rampant out here because of this very crime. Please be safe. Please make sure you look around your surroundings. People looting stores and damaging property. Authorities say they hit multiple locations, including a Lululemon, Foot Locker, and Apple store. Police making more than 20 arrests, but dozens likely got away. These kinds of smash and grab crimes have become all too common, forcing a growing number of retailers to try to combat the thefts. This morning, one of them, Target, is taking drastic action to reduce retail crime. The company announcing it'll shut down nine stores by the end of October. Three in both San Francisco. But look at nine stores. Look at two in Seattle and one in New York. Look at that's nothing. The company blaming the closures on theft and organized retail crime, threatening the safety of our team and guests. This is crazy. Come on, man. They're locking up the toothpaste. The move nine. Comes after Why they say nine stores is because you know. November is nueve. Nueve is nine. Shit's gonna go down. I'm telling you, man. November time. Shit is about to get real. And I'm in the heart of this shit. Despite our efforts, we continue to face fundamental challenges. Brooklyn Strong, baby. These stores. Target is not alone. In 2021, Walgreens closed five locations in San Francisco over shoplifting fears. And while Walmart and Nordstrom have also closed some locations in major cities, neither blamed crime. Still, in a newly released survey conducted by the National Retail Federation, 88% of responding retailers <laughs> said shoplifters have become more 88. and 28% say 88 have some locations due to crime. Retailers are experiencing the unprecedented numbers. levels of theft, crime, and violence in their in their stores. Now, as another major retailer There's shuts the target. down stores, retail crime so. threatens to knock the industry off target. Today, coming in at you. And 100 billion dollars in inventory that's 100 been billion place or stolen experts say if more isn't done to update policies on retail crime consumers could pay more and more stores could be shut down all of this especially concerning ahead of the what did I tell you season. millions of Americans and now look at this next one it's coming it's coming NBC's Ryan crisis this, this crisis album. that and if you didn't see this before you got child care funding at risk Millions of families could lose access at the end of the week. Now, I'm not trying to make anybody scared. This is just to make you aware of what's going on. Things are happening super fast. Okay? Just distractions behind us. Listen, just be alert. Pay attention. Stay focused. When you step out and you travel in public, just look at your surroundings. Try to travel in the light. And if you see somebody, try to walk with somebody close to somebody and not look like you're by yourself. All right, be safe out there, people. We are near. I just hope that it's not too crazy and we see the light. So, again, if we definitely see a blackout, then you know shit is about to go down. We're going to wake. Lights are going to go on and shit's going to be changed. So, anyway, thank you for liking, watching, subscribing. Love you guys. And if anything, you want to send a little love at I Told You So Wallet. God bless.